Hugh Norman Ross born July 24, 1945, is a Canadian Christian apologist, and Old Earth creationist. Ross obtained his Ph.D. in astronomy from the University of Toronto and his B.Sc. degree in physics from the University of British Columbia. He established his own ministry in 1986, called Reasons to Believe that promotes progressive and day-age forms of Old Earth creationism. Ross accepts the scientific consensus on the Big Bang theory, the age of the Earth and the scientific age of the universe, however he rejects Darwinian evolution and abiogenesis as explanations for the history and origin of life. <laughs> Early life and education Hugh Ross was born in Montreal, Quebec and raised in Vancouver, British Columbia. Ross earned a B.Sc. in Physics from the University of British Columbia and an M.Sc. and Ph.D. in Astronomy from the University of Toronto, and he was a postdoctoral research fellow for five years at Caltech, studying quasars and galaxies. Topic apologetic career Before starting Reasons to Believe, Ross was on the ministerial staff at Sierra Madre Congregational Church. In addition to apologetics writing, Ross speaks regularly in academic venues and churches, as well as regular podcasts I Didn't Know That, formerly Creation Update, and Science News Flash. He spoke at the 2008 Skeptics Society Origins Conference at California Institute of Technology alongside Nancy Murphy, Victor Stenger, Kenneth R. Miller, Sean Carroll, Michael Shermer, and Leonard Suskind. Ross has publicly debated scientists Jerry Coyne, Eugenie Scott, Victor Stenger, Peter Ward, Louis Wolpert, Michael Shermer, Peter Atkins and Rob Tarswell. Ross has also debated young Earth creationists, including Ken Ham, Kent Hovind, Dwayne Gish, Danny Faulkner, Andrew McIntosh, John Morris and Ray Comfort. In 2012 he won the Trotter Prize, delivering the Trotter Lecture at Texas A&M University on Theistic Implications for Big Bang Cosmology. Topic. Creationism Ross believes in progressive creationism, which posits that while the Earth is billions of years old, life did not appear by natural forces alone but that a supernatural agent formed different life forms in incremental progressive stages, and day-age creationism which is an effort to reconcile a literal genesis account of creation with modern scientific theories on the age of the universe, the Earth, life, and humans. He rejects the young Earth creationist YEC position that the Earth is younger than 10,000 years, or that the creation days of Genesis chapter 1 represent literal 24-hour periods. Ross instead asserts that these days translated from the Hebrew word yom are historic, distinct, and sequential, but not 24 hours in length nor equal in length. Ross and the RTB team agree with the scientific community that the vast majority of YEC arguments are pseudoscience and that any version of intelligent design is inadequate if it doesn't provide a testable hypothesis which can make verifiable and falsifiable predictions, and if not, it should not be taught in the classroom as science. Ross is a critic of young Earth creationists, in particular Russell Humphreys and Ken Ham. Topic. Bibliography Ross has written or collaborated on the following books The Fingerprint of God. Orange, Caliph, Promise Publishing, 1989, 2nd ed. 1991, 3rd ed. 2005 ISBN 978-0939497188 the Creator and the Cosmos. Colorado Springs, Navpress, 1993, 2nd ed. 1995, 3rd ed. 
2001 ISBN 978-0891097006 Creation and Time. Colorado Springs, Navpress, 1994 ISBN 978-0891097761 Beyond the Cosmos Colorado Springs, Navpress, 1996, 2nd ed. 1999, Orlando, Florida, Signalman Publishing, 2010, 3rd ed. ISBN 978-0984061488 The Genesis Question, Colorado Springs, Navpress, 1998, 2nd ed. 2001 ISBN 978-1576831113 The Genesis Debate, Mission Viejo, C.A., Crux, 2002 with five other authors. ISBN 978-0970224507 Lights in the Sky and Little Green Men, Colorado Springs, Navpress, 2002 ISBN 978-1576832080 A Matter of Days, Colorado Springs, Navpress, 2004 ISBN 978-1576833759 Origins of Life, Colorado Springs, Navpress, 2004 with Fazale Rana ISBN 978-1576833445 Colorado Springs, Navpress, 2005 with Fazale Rana. ISBN 978-1576835777 Creation as Science, Colorado Springs, Navpress, 2006 ISBN 978-1576835784 why the Universe is the Way It Is, Grand Rapids, Michigan, Baker Books, 2008 ISBN 978-0801071966 More Than a Theory, Grand Rapids, Michigan, Baker Books, 2009 ISBN 978-0801041420 Hidden Treasures in the Book of Job, How the Oldest Book of the Bible Answers Today's Scientific Questions, Baker Books, 2011 ISBN 978-0801072109 Navigating Genesis, A Scientist's Journey Through Genesis Chapters 1-11, 2014 ISBN 978-1886653863 Improbable Planet, How Earth Became Humanity's Home Baker Books, 2016 ISBN 9780801016899 Additionally, he has contributed to the following volumes The Creation Hypothesis, Downers Grove, Eel, Intervarsity Press, 1994 ISBN 978-0830816989 Mere Creation, Downers Grove, Eel, Intervarsity Press, 1998 ISBN 978-0830815159 why I Am a Christian, Grand Rapids, Michigan, Baker Book House, 2000 ISBN 978-0801012105 The Day I Met God, Sisters, O.R., Multnomah 2001 ISBN 978-1576737866 Videos Journey Toward Creation 2003 Dual Revelation Chapter 2008 UFO Files 2004 Topic. See also Age of the Earth Anthropic Principle Astronomy Biblical Cosmology Cosmology Creator God Dating creation 
Fine-tuned universe Genesis creation narrative Timeline of cosmological epochs <laughs>